<clears throat> right, so your skip um, essentially would put you here, except for the flag to trigger the scene doesn't happen until you beat that boss, right? Going back to my hometown, I'll go as far as, with you as far as that. I guess it's the start of our journey. You hate traveling? I don't know, but I don't have anywhere else to go, so I guess it doesn't really matter. I will. I'll do it right now. Jeez, that's so cool. <clears throat> Left Midgar, really? It's dangerous. Sure you want to go? I thought you'd say that. We told Aerith's we told mom to go somewhere safe. Marlene should be safe, too. Yeah. Yeah, she should be. That's, yeah. That's pretty, that's pretty dope. Then, let's go. <clears throat> to northeast, there's a small mining town called Calm. Quiet town and out of the way. We don't, why don't we head there first? You're right. You're right. I heard that, heard about that town before. What do you think, Cloud? Yo, about Sephiroth and the crisis of the planet. We need a leader for our journey, of course. That could only be me. Yeah, dude, that fucking looks amazing. You think so? Yeah. Robot oh, enemy. <clears throat> you could still... Oh, okay, yeah, no, I know what you're talking about now. Yeah, Adam PHS. <clears throat> Glad they gave the PHS to you now. Access to the main menu, select PHS, the world map, or a save point. And besides that, we can't be strolling around together out there. It's too dangerous. Let's split into two parties. Let's see, who should I take? Um, I like Barrett as a tank, but he doesn't really. I don't really have enough materia slots for him to give him the two covers. The dead grass area, though. I'm gonna do Tifa and Aerith. I'm gonna take just the ladies. <coughs> Let's put you in the front row. I'll keep you in the front row. Give her a cure just in case she needs to like do a super big heavy duty cure. I'll give her fire. I'll give her poison and heal. So like this this area, this kind of like rocky plains area. See, this, I think, would be really hard to recreate. Yeah, I did. <clears throat> I got it second try. Added effect, yeah, would have been really nice here, but added yeah, what it is. Oh, why do I have cure all? Oh, Jesus. No, give me back my shotgun. Why'd you steal the shotgun? All the things to steal. Back that shotgun. Not you too. Dirty bomb, I'm fine with that. I know, right? Jeez. What sucked. that shotgun with our life. Jesus. 
<clears throat> oh, I need the steel materia, don't I? That might help. if I should keep her with life. I don't think she should have life. I'm gonna give her counterattack. Oh, I should... get rid of the four slots on him. Give it... I know I lose that buff for magic, but I can then give her a five and do Osmos instead. She's going to be using a lot of magic. Now doing the world map here is going to be difficult if you're trying to remake it because it's full 3D environments. You'd have to... Haha! -ha! Capture scope. Steel. Echo drops. Nothing to steal. Oh, with, oh, with seven? Yeah, I was talking about for your mod, but yeah, I know. I think it's, it'll be interesting how they do the open world aspect. Um, they might do it like 12, um, but that would be a bit disappointing for me, honestly. I would like to see it be a le like a legit open world. Um, style like, you know, Skyrim or Witcher, something like that. Um, just because... Let's get rid of Steel. You know, they could add a lot more, they could add a lot more to it, a lot more to the world. UVs. Yeah, <clears throat> a life system would be nice. Adding trees and forests just to kind of enrich it would be cool. If being, to be able to rip it would be nice. If you could rip the map and throw it into some type of editor and then re-import it, it would just be interested, interesting to see how the engine handles it. We've reached calm. Everything's waiting at the end. Let's go, Cloud. Well then, I'll go on ahead. <clears throat> okay, so I don't know if anybody else ever notices this, but that's Marlene in that window right there. Because you know in that final cutscene when it jumps down here and goes into the window and Marlene's there? She's still there. In that window. Up in the upper left. That's sad. That's really sad that they're all gone. So, that just proves that they modeled this town in 3D and then put it in a camera angle and took a screenshot of it. Yeah, you can't go through there, but that's 100% her in that, in that tower. I never see anybody else point that out. Materia store. And that, no, you can't get up in that one. Can you? Ooh, hey, Bear. Long trip, better be prepared. Yo, lead him, man. How about spending, how about spending some of that money you leached off me? He's, <laughs> aww.
No, that's a, I thought that was a different room. Mithril Claw! Ooh. Full Metal Staff. Mithril Claw. Let's see. I guess I'll buy a Cannonball, too. Okay, let's see. I'll go, I'll go check. Because I thought that that was technically something else. Is this the right room? No. Is this the one? But even then, yeah, no, that's that's not even in the same area. First house, but far left. Ah, I see. I suppose it is. Oh yeah, you're right, huh? But, even then, they still took the, um, they still took the, uh, screenshot of her s waiting there in that area. Like, that's Marlene. That's her head. That's 100% her head and her hands, and she's, like, praying. <clears throat> I know she's, like, technically she's not there, but... The screenshot, the background image that they used, is the one that starts off that scene. Um, because the camera angle starts in this angle and then goes up into that window. Like, hold on, I want to show this. I'm, I'm going to show this here to you. Guarantee you, guarantee you, that it's just a screenshot from that first opening frame. I know it's just a screenshot from that first opening frame of her, because that's 100% her in that window. <laughs> how many people do you have? This town's quiet. How many people do you have working on it? We'll loot this town for everything it's worth. Give me that, Ether. It's like they hid the final movie scene. Oh, jeez, yeah. What you do is that you have a section for everybody who's just additional voices, and then you just have all their names under that section for additional voices. What are you... Get off the bed. I would see you according to the small human of the avalanche was blamed for the president's death. Not surprised Shinron never tells the truth. So that avalanche left the new president badly injured. Well, of course they... Oh. I guess that one's true. <laughs> Did they mention that he didn't have his shotgun? True. <clears throat> That's not too bad, though. I mean, think of it, if it's just first and last names... Why did this guy have his dog under the, under the frickin... Isn't that like animal abuse? Ether. Lots of ethers. I like that. Locked. Um, but, believe it or not, 200 names actually isn't that... Isn't a whole lot. Like, a lot of, like... You type a lot faster than you think. It seems like a big daunting number, but it's really not that bad. Think of it as think of it like a <clears throat> you know, like maybe like a 400 word essay, you know, cuz people have a first and last name and probably a lot of them are just handles. 
high potion. That'd be cool. Does it say locked in the original, or is that like an added thing? I feel like it always said locked. Did I already get that? I think I did. I feel like it's always been like, locked. Got my health and enough to eat, I guess all's well. It's funny because there's like, obviously stuff that they did that they're like planning for other things that they kind of just lazily covered up. You're late, but you guys were all outside just a second ago. It locked? Isn't there like a mega elixir in there? Oh, that's right. I think I know what's gonna happen. Yo, man, you're late! Sorry to keep you waiting. Guess everyone's here now. So let's hear your story. You know, the one about Sephiroth and the crisis face on the earth. Let's hear it all. And not skip any of it. Keep it short. We don't want to go through all of that. And that's the end of my story. Wait a damn minute, ain't there more? <laughs> I don't remember. What happened to Sephiroth? Didn't you fight him? I don't know. The rest is... blank. Official record states Sephiroth is dead. I read it in the newspaper. Shinra owns the newspapers, so you can't rely on that information. I want to know the truth. I want to know what happened. I challenged Sephiroth and lived. Why didn't he kill me? I'm alive too. A lot of this doesn't make sense. What about Genova? It was in the Shinra building, right? Shinra shipped it from Nibelheim to Midgar. Did someone carry it out later? It was missing from the Shinra building. Sephiroth. <gasps> bum bum bum. Damn, ain't, ain't, ain't none of this makes sense. I'm going Going, going, gone. And I'm leaving the thinking to you. Yo, Cloud. We gonna stop him, right? I don't know. Right. Alright then, we gonna rock. Oh, brother. Cloud? What's he just doing? Did he just pass out at the top of the stairs? When... Cut me. I thought you were a goner. It was really sad. I was really sad. I, Cetra Genova, Sephiroth, and myself. It's getting late. We should get some sleep. What? What a fascinating story. Whoa. She just comes out of nowhere and just steals everything. Does Barrett have a thing against, like, sleeping in a bed? Hey! Wake up, there's a thief! What's, what's going on? Oh, damn, come on! Oh, it's not like she took materia. Or money. <gasps> Where'd everybody go? Dum 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 dum. There's no sign of her. Did she get away? I think I can track her. Just follow me. You losers, caught up. You robbed the wrong <laughs> you robbed the wrong train, fool. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> Why did she attack automatically? Ah, uh, Tifa has such a low hit rate. It bothers me. Perfect dodge lost. Perfect dodge on. 
<gasps> I don't have any steel. Damn it. I'll have steel. This ain't going well. I'll have to use that. Uh Oh god, Aerith Aerith is gone. I didn't try I didn't have any steel materia. I didn't think about that. Can't believe I lost. Yo, you spiky-headed jerk! Rematch, come on, let's go! Not interested. It would. Thinking of running away, stay and fight! Fight, I said! Don't let her out of our, your sight. You don't see one like that every day. Who's that girl? What's up with the broad? Come on, what's the matter? Let me guess. You guys are scared of me, huh? Yeah, sure. We're petrified. Hmm, just as I thought. What do you expect with my ninja skills? Well, whatever. I'll let you off this time later. I'm really gonna leave. I mean it. Go ahead. We got our stuff back and you're giving me a headache. No, you dope. You're supposed to say, wait, don't go. Ugh, whatever. You guys are clueless. Just can't leave you like this. You won't last a second. You won't last a second out there without me. Guess I have no choice. I'll tag. I'll take you along with me. You've got to be kidding. Come on. Let's get out of here. Huh, huh? Hey, hey. Wait a minute. Where are you going? Oh, nice. I got the achievement for Yuffie. And it was scripted. Me, me, me. I'm Yuffie. Good to meet ya. Eh <laughs> Now. Qu not quite how I planned it, but now all I gotta do is a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Nya, nya, nya. Hey, wait up. Wait for me. You ain't coming with us. Beat it. Like it matters what you want. I'll follow you anyway. When hit by physical damage, Yuffie will temporarily gain 250% physical evasion. She will lose the effect of perfect dodge after a few turns if she, or if she, or if she is the target of any magic-based actions. 